Drowning in famine, natural disasters. My baby has been around for me. Kingdoms have fallen, angels be calling. None of that could ever make me leave. Yeah. Every time I look into guys welcome to my channel thank you so much for everyone who decided to click on this video thank you guys for all the subscriptions the likes the comments the engagement the interaction it means absolutely everything to me that is what makes the channel i don't make the channel you guys make the channel so just seeing that type of growth means absolutely everything to me because you know what i do so thank you very much so um i know i haven't said anything on this vlog since it began and i can explain so yesterday i went to do my nails Atlekhang, you the bomb, babe. If you guys would like to do your nails from Atlekhang, I will just leave her handle here on the screen and then you can check her out. But she's really dope. So I went to fix my nails. I did a refill because I still had the other set on. It's just that it was just going up. Like the nails were going up. They were lifting. So I just figured, okay, instead of just starting a new set, let me do a refill and change the design. So that's what I did yesterday. And then I took my brother to Carnival City, as you guys saw. So at Carnival City, I really couldn't speak to you guys because... It was loud. The music was out of this world. So I was thinking, you know what? I'm gonna get copyrighted because, okay, I don't know if you guys know that about YouTube, but somebody else's song is not supposed to play on your video or else 
if you make money from your video is going to go to that person or your video will just be blocked from certain countries and if it's south africa then you guys are not going to be able to watch it you know what i mean so i'm always cautious that's why you will never hear like any form of popular music on my videos i'm just avoiding copyrights so that's why i could not speak to you guys yesterday but mostly i just want to give you guys a breakdown of what's been happening in my life to me altogether you know so I think I'm very much in a good space, like career-wise, life-wise, relationship-wise, friendship-wise, family-wise. I'm good. Money-wise, God is coming through for the girl. But I feel like I'm in a new space right now in my life where I'm surrounded by people who are, I find negative. I'm not going to lie. I find them negative, right? And I can tell you why. So um, these particular people would like ill-speak the things that I do hustle wise so you guys know that i do so many things on the side outside work or anything like that like i'm a hustling girl guys i'm about my bag i'm about my money right so i think being in a space where like you're surrounded by people who don't really understand the things that you're doing for money is a bit off because they speak so badly about the things that are actually bringing opportunities your way these same people would like speak ill about my youtube channel so you know when you're chilling and then you hear some someone speaking about mm, Nami, I must buy from Sheen so I can say, yeah, guys, um, so if you, you want to buy size 4, you have to get CN37, and oh, guys, I got this blush from, uh, no, 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 and then people are laughing, right? And then you can tell, you no, man, these people are actually talking about me, they're talking about my channel, and they're making fun of my channel. So, like, with me, when it comes to, like, YouTube, YouTube is my safe space, YouTube is my like if i want to relax if i want to have a peace of mind i just go to youtube because i can be myself i feel like most of the time i can't be myself like during the day because i'm very multifaceted and i don't feel that anybody can take that side of me honestly but on my youtube i can do anything i can be anything this is my space this is a space that i created but if obviously people are going to come here and then take from this channel and go outside and criticize the things that i'm doing obviously it's not going to be good for my health it wouldn't be good for anybody's health right so those are just a few things that i have been exposed to like you know and it's stuff that i had to get past but like my boyfriend was just telling me like when i was you know having that conversation with him because you know what if you feel like this about this particular situation that is letting you know how much you feel like or how important youtube is to you even though you can say that no youtube is, is like your fan space or whatever it simply means also it's very important to you and then you have to take it seriously you know what i mean so i've decided to take my youtube super seriously now i think it's going to show with more videos to come that now i'm not taking it as a hobby or like a play thing that i do i'm taking it as literally a business so you guys are just going to see how things are gonna unfold i want to get a camera i want to get like proper equipment for myself i just got a laptop which i really like so mostly i'm not gonna have to use my cell phone to edit as well i know i'm using it to shoot right now but at least i can use my laptop to edit my videos and stuff like that so i'm really excited about that and also another thing guys i think you're gonna be seeing more of my face on my channel than anybody else so it doesn't mean that like maybe if i'm out with my friends or if i'm out with my boyfriends you're not gonna get to see them yes you absolutely will but what i mean is i'm gonna start like doing things alone now so that's another thing that i thought about like i never do anything alone i, I never go to a restaurant alone i never go i would never go to a zoo alone i would never go to a theme park alone i would never even book in alone because i just feel like i reserve nice things to do with the people that are around me and the people that are in my life and i don't know why if i'm being honest i don't know why but there's something about doing things without the people that i love that would like turn me off but i've been realizing lately that no but the people that i love and the people that are in my life they're able to do things outside me or they're able to do things without thinking about me or considering me or feeling like i have to be a part of it you know so if everybody is swifting through life so easily without me why can i not do the same for myself you know and sometimes you need that one time you need to be alone for a while you need to just be in a position where you can sit and think for yourself without thinking about anybody else and think about your life Reroots, my brother is making noises out of me. He's watching Netflix. Um, so yeah, guys, you're gonna be seeing more of my face, you're gonna be seeing me trying out new things alone. Um, I love that about myself, I love the decision that I've taken. 
so um i hope you guys are gonna like it i hope you guys are gonna like enjoy more of the content that's gonna come on this channel and right now we're actually going to a spa so i put myself into a spa not so far from here the name of the spa is ex woman beauty i believe ex woman beauty spa and salon something like that so that's where we're going right now i need to quickly take a bath never rising never fresh never you know like be a hygienic queen and then go mbangene because i'm into it guys like i'm into it i'm into resetting i'm into taking care of myself right now so it has to show right it's july right now in october november i really want to see major improvements in my life in terms of skin body health you know what but i feel like the things that i'm talking about are gonna require me to cut on so many things that i like but it is what it is guys let's get it going
it is definitely monday and we are in the mall which is absolutely annoying but i don't really have a choice guys i don't have anything to use currently on my face or anything like that because everything is finished so as you guys are seeing me right now i'm going into clicks to get everything that i need for my skincare routine everything that i need for my female hygiene routine so let's go i'm outside in a damn jeep right outside tt two turn baby girl you know me still with the dolls that i grew beside all the niggas brown me so tired guys i'm done now so i was able to get most of the stuff that i was looking for except i didn't get the dawn that i was looking for they don't have dawn at all it's clear it's your nivea it's your everything you can think of but dawn is there so i think i'm just gonna call my mom and then ask her to come with dawn for me from where she is but right now mostly i have to uber back home um just let me know what you think guys if you did enjoy this video please give it a big thumbs up and if you like this type of content just let me know down below I don't know man i don't know about this vlog because i don't usually do this type of content but if you like it then you might get more of it so just let me know thank you so much for tuning in until my next video